So I woke up this morning feeling really good, not even close to having any hallucinations, no delusions, no paranoia, not even close to any of that. So I decided I wanted to face one of my fears and that was going to the store alone. I know that sounds really silly to say, like granted I'm 23 and like going to the store alone, like it's more of a fear of being out in public by myself, just with my paranoia. But I wanted to face the fear today because I was feeling really good. And just overall, I just, I felt like it was a good day to do that. So let's cut to the chase and let's get in there. I know it really seems silly to be scared of the public, but just, it's one of those things I've just never really gotten over over the past six years. I used to be fine before I got sick, but it's just one of those things I haven't really gotten over yet. And I hope it doesn't come off as attention seeking to vlog my experiences. It's just I wanted to document my schizophrenia just as a way to cope with it. And one of the goals I have with these videos is to destigmatize schizophrenia with at least some people because a lot of people have a lot of misunderstandings with schizophrenia as far as like what people do is if you have schizophrenia. All right, that was successful. All right, so not too bad. I know I'm making him a big deal out of nothing, but. That was good. That was a good try. That was good. But now we're going to go to the park and we're going to shoot some hoops and we're going to do some other stuff as well. I know I missed almost every shot, but I had a lot of fun. This was the first time shooting hoops at this park since I became sick six years ago. So it was a big step for me to come here alone. Having a good mental health is what's important in life. I may just be on a high of a wavy emotional swing, but I would trade anything in the world to feel like I did when I was shooting hoops. For the first time in I don't know how long, I could focus on something outdoors and my worry of hallucinating went away for 5 minutes. I don't care what anyone says about being indoors or outdoors, doing things in the sun help people with schizophrenia tremendously. These past few months have been hard with the cold weather, but now that it's spring, I plan on pushing past my fears and going outside more. But if you ever run into someone with schizophrenia who has these fears of normal everyday activities, just be understanding. So how can you be understanding with someone that has schizophrenia? What is being understanding to me? Simply by learning more about schizophrenia. There's tons that everyone needs to learn about schizophrenia. Stuff that I even need to learn about myself. It's just like any type of mental health awareness. The more people that know the ins and outs, the less stigmatized schizophrenia will be. Schizophrenia is not an illness that makes you harmful or mean or dangerous. It's just a part of some people that make you think weird things. Overall, I had a good day going out and facing my fears of being alone in the public. So hopefully I feel better more days and I can just do this kind of thing more often. But make sure to subscribe if you want to learn more about my schizophrenia. And thank you for watching. Until next time, see you later.